You're watching Alaska's Weather Source. Hey, welcome back. If you are headed out and about later this evening, maybe for an afternoon evening walk or stroll uh, or headed out uh, on the town, we are seeing a nice break in the clouds. Uh, if you look very closely, there's some blue sky trying to peek through. Uh, we are seeing dry conditions for the moment, but there's still a chance the shower moves through. Temperature wise, we have come down uh, quite a bit, sitting at 61 degrees, not too far off from what's normal for this time of year, but uh, definitely cooler than we've been the past couple of days. Still in the mid 60s here through mid Town and the east side. You're at 62 in Eagle River, 62 on the south side at New Seward and Huffman. But compared to this time yesterday, we're down seven degrees here in Anchorage. And we're seeing that drop really uh, for much of the state as some cooler air is pushing in as we're starting to see a return to active weather this week. We do still have, again, dangerous fire conditions north of Fairbanks. That's where we're seeing that combination of uh, frequent lightning, warm conditions, dry weather, and also still seeing some breezy winds there as well. Here in South Central, we are going to see more chances for showers both overnight tonight and tomorrow. Uh, what we see here at Anchorage will likely mostly fall in the second half of the day. And again, it's not much uh, seeing heavier rain as you head further south and further to the east with uh, the heaviest rain actually out across Prince William Sound and down into southeast. High temperatures for you there tomorrow will also be back into the low to mid 60s. Pretty steady rain further south from Sitka into Ketchikan and up into Juneau. Further north, though, it'll be more scattered showers with some sun breaks in between there. Across the Kenai Peninsula, be prepared for those scattered showers, again, especially along the coast. High temperatures close to 60 degrees there tomorrow. Through Prince William Sound, we're also going to see temperatures holding right at about 60. 68 as you head up into the Copper River Basin. Some morning rain, but then you should clear up for the second half of the day. But we will continue to see chances for those showers through the valley tomorrow uh, with high temperatures back into the mid-60s. Mid-60s, uh, again, eventually in Anchorage. Tomorrow, 62 for the high temperature. We'll see some light rain again, mainly in the second half of the day. Those mid-60s do return here on Thursday up to 66, even with a chance for some showers remaining. I expect drier and warmer conditions Friday, Saturday, some more sunshine to go with it. Uh, Sunday, even into early Monday, we'll see chances for some additional rain with high temperatures there in the mid-60s. But then looking well ahead, uh, seven, eight days from now, I do expect some more sunshine, drier conditions, a nice little stretch of weather uh, after uh, kids are getting ready to head back to school. So hard to believe that some Summer is beginning to wind down, at least when you look at the school calendar. Again, uh, first day of school for Anchorage students is a week from next Thursday. Oh, my gosh.